Hey YouTube, what goes on? And welcome back to another episode of Dis About Action Figures. And again, this is not a toy hunt, this is a Halloween hunt. Yes, we're hunting Halloween decor and decorations here at the Spirit Halloween. First time we're going into the Allentown store and actually filming this year. Uh, recently we did post a, a very comprehensive video from the Hazleton, Pennsylvania Spirit Halloween. But as I was walking around in here, I thought, you know what? There's probably some new stuff that we didn't see at the last store or just some other stuff that I want to show again that I really enjoyed uh, as far as masks and their, their other decor go. Uh, again, this is not typically a, a year-long Halloween channel. This is more action figures and pop culture and things like that that we enjoy doing. Uh, however, in spooky season, we transition into spirit Halloween, uh, Halloween hunts, Halloween haunts, different uh, amusement parks and attractions that we enjoy for this time of year. So uh, if you're into that kind of thing and you want to check us out, please consider hitting that subscribe button. It's free for you. It doesn't cost you anything and it helps us grow the channel tremendously the march to 5,000 subscribers leave a comment down below let me know if the favorite thing you saw was inside the store uh and again if you're usually here for the toy stuff and you're not checking this out or you're going to jump off the video now it's, it's all good I, I, it's fine there'll probably be a toy and video out like the day after this but let's see what they have inside and also six packs of knickknacks with us give a follow and a sub on instagram and on youtube let's see what they have inside. all right so i had no intention of filming a video here until i realized that the stuff that i did not see in my original Spirit Halloween walkthrough in Hazleton. This is one of the Allentown stores. So I'm gonna show you some stuff I missed or wasn't out. Yeah, that's not gonna fit in the living room at all, is it? <laughs> and this actually takes quite a while to go back down, so I'm not gonna play it the whole time. <laughs> it takes about another maybe 45 seconds for it to go down all the way and shut back off. But this thing is freaking sick. I don't think I see any prices for it, but this is one of the scarier ones I've seen. And I'm pretty sure we saw this one last time. But just because she's such a sweetheart, I thought I'd show it to you again. I'm pretty sure this ghost wasn't at Hazelton either. This one's a little bit more simple. Than that, than that guy. <laughs> but it's still pretty cool. It's certainly a ghost. Got the freaking gargoyle here. And again, a lot of this stuff we saw at the Hazleton store. But even though it's an updated video, I'll show you some of the stuff I liked. Like that guy. And then over here, this wasn't hooked up. The guy behind me is really trying to take uh, take all the attention away, isn't he? Bye, Mr. Spider. Bye. And again, some of the stuff I might have shown in the last video, I, I can't remember everything, uh, but I feel like I did not see this. Maybe we did, uh, but either way, it's not functioning right now. You probably have to pull something out, but uh, again, Killer Clowns, great piece. And of course, he's always there stabbing the pumpkin. And this is the main guy I don't think we saw at the Hazleton store. We saw plenty of Mars Attacks actual merchandise, but not the actual Mars Attacks animatronic. I thought I saw in a video that supposedly the arms do move. Obviously this one they're not, so in on the comments, am I wrong? Or are the hands supposed to be moving, or are the arms supposed to be moving in some capacity? And as this is typically an action figure kind of pop culture nerd channel, I say nerd in a, uh, a happy way. There's a Gambit costume for X-Men this year. X-Men 97 branded. So again, very cool. Are there more are there other ones? Just all Gambit. Looks like just Gambit here. But that's a really good idea. And as far as masks are concerned, I don't think we saw these either. They do have masks for Spiky and Jumbo from Killer Clowns. Uh, they also have obviously the actual outfits to go with those. There's a female Shorty, Spiky, uh, Jumbo. But yeah, fun seeing this stuff. Cross body bag. There you go, some more of your Killer Clowns merch. And uh, back here, I actually have this mask. <laughs> I picked this up um, for Halloween to wear one year, and even though I own it, it's still terrifying. <laughs> you have the devilish demon, the devil himself, devil suit, devil kit, uh, headband, the gothic devil, devious devil, lots of devils. I didn't know there were so many devils to choose from. What do you think, Six Packs? Pretty cool. I pick up their cool shirt. It's uh, It's got the spirit. You picked up some shirts today already, haven't you? I have. I have. Um, 
I have picked up some shirts. <laughs> Take a guess what cartoon he might have uh, picked up some shirts for. And I'll give you a hint. It's not the most obvious one that you would think he'd pick up. It's not the Jets. And the uh, top part here inside the setup is also different this time. I think in Hazleton it was just, at least I only went in once in Hazleton, but so maybe it alternates. Uh, but this is much cooler than the one I saw. Um, this is so awesome how they do these different uh, images and videos here inside the display in the front. We were just saying what a brand Spirit Halloween has really built itself into um, with between the merchandise and t-shirts and hats and just everything else. It's just a real scream. And I know we did show the pops off in Hazleton, but I think some of these might be different than what we saw. So they have the Spirit Halloween exclusives, Chuckles, Killer Clowns with Bibbo, with Shorty in the pizza box right there. Uh, I, I'm pretty sure we saw the Victor and Emily at the other store. Uh, but again, it's always cool seeing exclusive stuff when you are in these One of my stores. personal favorites that we saw in Hazleton. <laughs> this is how I feel every Monday morning. And six packs, gonna walk us through the backpacks here. Then you jump out at you. You got uh, SpongeBob, uh, <laughs> one of the scariest bags around. Uh, and then Scooby Doo, it's flocked. <laughs> Get your flocked Scooby-Doo backpacks. Yeah, they only have two here. flocking bags. <laughs> At Spirit Halloween. <laughs> Sam, Sam I am. MacArthur Road in Alton. <laughs> um, I don't think we saw this in Hazleton. <laughs> that is that is next level right there. I don't know what to tell you. It is crazy. Um, <laughs> got the pig mask down here. Uh, hanging bloody foot next to the severed foot. So if you want to hang it, you want a severed one, you know, you pick the one you want, the one you like best. Um, never get sick of walking through this store. And we're here till like, we come in here like till the first week of November till they finally cleared all out yeah, six packs. Yeah, yeah, until they move them out the floor. Yeah, like literally, when we, I think I mentioned in the last video, we're coming in like trying to buy like the displays, like that Frankenstein I might try to buy because <laughs> they basically sell almost everything at the end of the season uh, to just make whatever they can and basically you know, get it all over with. Stuffed dummy prop. Okay, now it's getting weird. I often wonder how desensitized the employees get from being in here. Because they constantly are bombarded with these sounds. And again, I did show a lot of this stuff last video as well, but I just like it. <laughs> Somebody keeps showing it. His hands are supposed to move and they're not doing much right now, but uh, got a, just a giant killer clown. You gotta show them, right? It's like a rule. All right, well, that's gonna do it here for our update video. And again, we saw some new stuff. Also, uh, some older things I liked from the first time I did a video. But if you'd like a more comprehensive video showing even more in Spirit Halloween, uh, I'll tag it down below from the first walkthrough we did uh, at the Hazleton store that opened in Pennsylvania. Uh, probably about three weeks ago now, which is crazy. But we might do a couple more videos from here. We'll see how it kind of goes. But thank you for watching. If you're new, please consider hitting that subscribe button. It's free for you. It does not cost you anything. And it helps the channel tremendously to march to 5,000 subscribers. Go ahead and hit that bell for notifications. That way, YouTube actually and tells you when we post new content to the channel, like our weekly toy and reviews and live streams. Leave a comment down below, hit the like button. And for daily toy content, daily toy updates, and daily Halloween hunt and haunt updates during the Halloween season, check us out over at Instagram and Twitter at disabout underscore 12. Take care, stay healthy. We'll be seeing all of you at the pegs.